world is made of dreamers. Those individuals who imagine a time and a place for family, for community, for achievement. The College of William & Mary is blessed to know one of those dreamers. A man who has created a field of dreams for the people he loves most. This is not about baseball. This is about the symbolism of drive and passion and dreaming because you have the support of people. Here's to you, Joe Plumeri, the biggest dreamer in the tribe. On a brisk March evening, friends and supporters of the College of William & Mary came to a small reception at the corner of Ironbound and Long Hill Road. It was an evening that won't be soon forgotten. From the very beginning, Joe wanted to give the college and the baseball program a facility of the highest quality in support of the college and to honor his family. During our many conversations that preceded Joe's decision to make this magnificent gift, he repeatedly expressed to me in terms that I never failed to understand that it was his, the unfailing love and support of his family throughout his career that had really made this possible. And Plumeri Park is a monument to that fact and will be in the future. The first plaque to be unveiled is in memory of Joe's father, Sam Plumeri. And while he is, of course, not here in person, we know enough about this man to be assured that this is a moment he would not miss. I first met Joe's father at homecoming in 1996. That was the weekend that Joe received the alumni medallion and made, as Terry said, the public announcement to give the college its first real baseball facility. Joe's father and I remember this very well, beamed with pride throughout the weekend. His love for Joe and his pride in his many accomplishments were very, very evident to me. In addition to his love for Joe and his family, Joe's father loved baseball. Let, let me rephrase that. He didn't just love baseball, he was passionate about baseball. To Sam, a baseball park was the perfect gift for his son to give the, the, to the college he loved. Baseball made a difference in his life, and he knew that this would be a lasting and an important contribution to all the young men attending the college. He was positive that it would be an asset to the Williamsburg community, just as his team, the Trenton Thunder, has been to Trenton, New Jersey. Now we unveil this plaque in his memory, and it is comforting to know that we will always feel his presence in Plumeri Park. Joe, let me come around and we'll do this together. distance uh, you are, unless you have far better eyesight than most people of the age sitting here do, it says Plumeri Park, given as a loving tribute by a devoted son, is dedicated to the memory of Samuel J. Plumeri Sr., a gentleman and a sportsman from Trenton, New Jersey. His passion for life, his family, his community and the game of baseball formed the foundation of his personal credo and distinguished him throughout his career. And at the bottom of this plaque is a statement that Sam made each year after watching spring practice. And if he were here tonight, I'm absolutely certain he would look at this park, size up the team and say, once again, I think we're gonna have a good ball club this year. This is not about baseball. It's called Plumeri Park because it's symbolic of a lot of things. It's symbolic of a park that to me is the definition of community, of people having a place to go, to feel good, 
to enjoy themselves in a bonding of the community of the college and the community of the of the town having a place to meet and to talk and enjoy themselves that's why it's called the park and it was definitively named a park for that reason why plumeri and not joseph plumeri or joe plumeri i learned a long time ago ladies and gentlemen that no man is an island and whatever good fortune i may have had is not solely based upon my hard work or my ambition but you have to have a lot of support and a lot of backup these plaques are tributes to the support and to the backup that I have received all my life from my family who is here with me today from my mother and my father um, who without them without my father's urging I would have never come here I can't remember ever a bleak day in my life where my father didn't have something positive to say it's a park it's about family it's about my parents it's about my father who taught me all of those things and if he hadn't stuck with me and if he hadn't hung in there with me and said that I could do whatever I chose to do if I worked hard and I dreamt and I had vision ladies and gentlemen I wouldn't be standing here this is not about baseball this is about the symbolism of drive and passion and dreaming because you have the support of people this is the symbolism of dreaming I don't know of a young boy of my generation or any generation whose first dream wasn't about being a big league ball player, who stood up at night and dreamt and looked at pictures or cards of major league ball players, who thought about maybe one day becoming Joe DiMaggio or whomever it might be. Baseball was the first dream of a young boy then and now. This is not about baseball. This is symbolic of dreaming. This is symbolic of hope and opportunity. I want people to understand that when they see this ballpark, that if they dream hard enough and they love their dream, anything's possible. And finally, it's symbolic of a young man's love for a special place, who if I did not have <laughs> this opportunity, that this man gave me, and this lady gave me, I would not be able to show the love that I feel for this special place. It is symbolic of that love. These monuments are enduring treasures and tributes to that love. This park is a monument to all of the things that I believe in. My family, this great college, and the enduring tribute and the love I give to it, and I give to it every day by virtue of this park being here. Thank you, everybody. God bless you. The emotional dedication ceremony is concluded with a tour of Plumeri Park. And a dinner in honor of the Plumeri family. The highlight of which was a presentation of a surprise gift of appreciation to Joe Plumeri. That's terrific. So what a wonderful thing.